how to check your client has internet connection or not we are going to see that in this video hi everyone this is subrat and you are watching fun of heuristics so on this channel you will get to know about the programming languages the framework and all about the algorithms so please consider subscribing and hit the bell icon if you haven't yet so checking the internet connection of the client is not that a big deal but it's that thing which increases the client usability or client experience to to a level and this you can use in lot of places so actually this question is asked by siddharth tyagi and so i thought it, it's better to make a video on it because this kind of minor details makes our application great so thanks siddharth and according to my knowledge you can achieve this in two way so one is by using the navigator.online or by using a event listener so first we'll go ahead and check the navigator.online and we are using the angular pw application here so which is the we have some certain video and i will link the playlist here you can go and watch that one and the github link will also be in the description you can check that one so as i told you first we'll see the navigator.online so we'll see that so i have written in the on in it so you can see that in on the load itself so we'll check here if like navigator dot online so it, it will return true if you have the internet connection and it will return false if you don't have the internet connection but here the demerit is it will run only once when your application is loaded so we'll go and check for the offline version and for now we'll just alert the user that please check your internet connection we're going to see the event listener a little later so i'll save the file and we'll start the server so here you don't need to build and you don't need to start a http server because this is a normal navigator and which is accessible uh, in the browser not through the service worker so it's fine if you run only ng serve so i will just bring the browser here and we'll type localhost 4200 and here you can see we are not seeing any alert because we have our internet connection till now so what i will do i will just turn off my wi-fi now i will just hit refresh here you will see please your check your internet connection because we have disconnected from the server then i will turn the wi-fi on again now if we will just refresh let it okay if i refresh you will it, you will see we haven't got any alert so this is how you can check uh, the user have the internet connection or not by using the navigator.online method but it's not that fancy it's not that type like always you can't use and i will let you know a scenario by using which your application can be benefited a lot so stay tuned till the end of the video now we will implement the event listener and which i think you guys will going to use a lot because it's a event listener so we'll just ignore this one so we'll comment this code here at event listener and here it will be online so first we'll go for offline and we'll just cast the event and you can run your code inside so for now i let it be blank and we'll just create another event listener and that is online and here we will implement our material snack bar so just to make it little fancy so i will go and add the angular material to our project so the material is added to our project now we'll go and import the snack bar module to our app module.ts so i will just import it here and we'll just import in our app module and save the file and we will go to our app component and here we'll inject our snack bar so it's a mat snack bar and we can use this to create the snack bar so it should be this dot dot open and here you can pass your message so we'll just copy this message because it's the online message and this is for your action so here we'll just say okay and now we'll pass a configuration which contain the duration 
will be for for now for the sake of video i'll just give five seconds because it will be a little longer and we'll just copy the same here and we'll just paste it here and just change the okay and we'll put this as two seconds because this is not required that much so i'll save so now we'll go to the, our browser and here we can see the offline and online condition so first i will go to the developer studio to the service worker in a file make it offline you can see you got your uh, snack bar and if you press ok it will go else it will go automatically for this is for two seconds and so i press offline again so it will just come as a offline once more so i'll just show you that again so i just make it online i'll just close now i will just switch off my router I means switch off my wi-fi here you can see you will get your connect internet connection is lost and if i switch it back again then you will get our internet connection it came back and that's what it's used for and as i told you i let you know a scenario which will help your application a lot and the scenario is suppose you are developing application and you you have a first amount of audience group so some audience are using 3g connection some audience are using 4g connection some audience are using the broadband or the fiber connection and this functionality will be pretty helpful by analyzing the how your audiences are so the use case here you can use is you can use the background sync you can use your index db and you can use this offline and online feature to enhance your application so think like your browser or your audience or a user is getting offline so you can make you can register a background sync call here and insert your data or the time uh, to the db and when when your connection will back now the background sync will going to call your server and if you don't know what is background sync and how it's work then i have a video i will link it there it is pretty useful so what i mean to say is if the user will close the browser also if they don't have the internet connection they usually close the browser but whenever we'll get the connection back then the background sync will send a message to a server and that's how you can record how many you how frequently the user is getting the connection lost in their in some particular region so in by using that you can decide which content to be cached properly in the application so that they will not face any problem while reading some blog or reading navigating through some posts and this functionality will will help your user or mainly those 3g users who have slow internet connection or like fluctuating internet connection so let me know in the comment section below that how you're gonna use this functionality in your application so that we can discuss a bit on this so that's it for today guys today we saw how you can check your client has the internet connection or not by using the navigator.online or by using the event listener which is online and offline and you can raise some snack bar which looks cool and how you can use this functionality to enhance your application and that we did discuss that we haven't implemented so please like the video if you are liking the video till now and please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you will not miss any video in the future and please share this video among your friends family colleagues so that everybody will be benefited and please give some valuable comment in the comment section below we will going to meet in the next video till that stay happy bye bye